Hey, what is up guys? MC here back with another video guys. Today we're doing a Warframe tutorial guys and this tutorial is basically on how to rank up your weapons slash Warframe slash Sentinels slash Cub Rose now. How to rank them up from 1 to 30 pretty darn fast. Uh, this is going to be a very simple tutorial but uh, you will need a couple things to make it at least go a little bit faster and smoother runs. So the, basically the planet you're going to be going on is going to be Pluto. Uh, it's right over here, uh, but I'm going to be using the, the Vuban, or the Vuboon, or however you say his name. Um, he is just going to be really good for this mission, because this mission is going to be def uh, de it's going to be defense, and it's going to be infestation. Uh, and the infestation, uh, they can get a little bit overwhelming, so it's good to keep them in big clumps with Vuban's Vortex. So if you don't have Vuban, it's alright, but if you have him, it will make this go a lot faster. So, first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get your weapon that you're going to be upgrading uh, mine, and it's going to be the Latron Prime, as you can see right here. It's only 17. I polarized it, and I gave it a V polarity spot. Uh, now I'm wanting to rank it up, so I'll show you guys how to do that pretty darn fast. Also, my NK Stilettos needs to be ranked up all the way to 32 as well, because uh, I haven't done that yet. But anyway, my Vuban is already 30, so we will jump right into it. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go all the way to Pluto which is not Circe's. We're going to go to Pluto, uh, and then we're going to go all the way to the Dark Sector Defense, which is right here. Bam, there we go. And looks like there is... <laughs> there is a conflict right now. So, well, okay, I guess I'll wait till this thing's over. Alrighty, here we go. We are in the Defense Mission, the Dark Sector. So, uh, it isn't too hard, honestly, but, uh, you will have to have maybe a couple people with you. Honestly, soloing it is a bit hard. Uh, the only thing bad about this mission is you will lag a lot if you have a crappy computer like mine. <laughs> so, um, anyway, it shouldn't be just a deadly horrible bad. I actually have my cover with me on this mission. He's looking pretty swagalicious with his little collar. He's that right, Kyo? Yeah, that's right. So, basically what you're going to want to do is just get a nice high position spot. Uh, my cover might get killed, but anyway, uh, you just kind of use your vortex as what I do. Get them in one big clump and then start firing away at that clump with whatever gun you want to upgrade it. And that will upgrade the gun dang fast, like really, really fast. But as you can see at the bottom of my screen, it's already going up like a lot. And actually my vortex is maxed out, but I need to get the continuity mod. Because I don't have that one yet, and that would make it last a lot longer than it already does. Uh, but that would help a lot. And these, the thing is, these things, these infested are very high levels. So when you kill a high level, you will get, um, I mean, a lot of ranking up skills. So that will go really, really, really fast. Like I said, you don't have to have Vortex, you can just shoot them if you want to. But the Vortex helps if you have a really weak gun and they can rank it up faster. And my cover is going all ham with this little bitches. But anyway, we're going to do it uh, on the next round, so uh, here we go. Alright, there we go. Wave cleared. After this next wave, I should rank up the Malatron Prime to 18, because look how close this sucker is. So we're just going to wait for a couple of them to more come, them to come, and then uh, we will activate our Vortex. Because the Vortex basically clumps them all up to one one giant ball of enemies, and you basically just have to just shoot fire right into that ball. And you don't have to aim really that much at all, so we'll do that, and we'll just start shooting on in that giant ball of reap and we should rank up to 18 here real soon but it goes super super fast like this is literally the best method the best method for getting your guys ranked up and it is really really good and like I said you don't have to have vortex you can just shoot fire at these guys they shouldn't be too hard to kill um, but if you want to do it a little bit easier one do the one on Neptune the dark survival the dark sector survival on Neptune and if it's still a little bit too hard do it on Uranus. No pun intended. Alright, anyway. I'm sure you guys, as you know, if you play Warframe, the longer, or the, the more, the higher your level rank is uh, on your weapon, the higher rank it is, the longer it's going to take to rank up even more. So let's say you're at 29. It may take a little bit longer to get to 30, but it will still get to 30 nonetheless. So let's just activate a Vortex, why don't we? And I'll start using my Stilettos. So here we go. Oh man, that's a lot. That's crap loaded. As you can see, it actually is going up. Like, literally, you can see the visual. It's literally going up as you see it. So that is fantastic. I have some super quick reload speed on these guns. Like, some serious reload speed. Holy crap. It's like, not even a second. But I just burned through all the ammo, so <laughs> isn't that nice? So 
There we go. We're gonna get my uh, Latron all the way up. Now let's do another Vortex. There we go. Suck them all up and hit fire. Let's go. I really need to get a reload or a fire rate on this gun. But look at that, guys. You can see it's almost ready to go to 18. So that is crazy good. That can really help a lot. So there we go. It's just about to 18. So anyway, guys, that's basically the tutorial. I uh, hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, click the like button down below. And uh, subscribe today to join the feline pack. And if you guys are new to the channel, go check out my other Warframe videos I got. I do tutorials and all that other, other kind of stuff. But uh, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And I will see all you guys in the next video. Stay cool, guys, and peace out.